this is going to take some time to get over. You know, these these hurt because they leave some deep wounds. But again, we'll, we'll learn from them. We'll be better uh, for it. Wisconsin's a very special place. Um, and so we're proud of what we're about, where we're at, and where we're going. This program is uh, in great hands. I mean, Wisconsin needs to be at the top, and this is the standard. And throughout this year, I think we worked really hard. We put in a lot of work, and we saw it pay off, and we kind of realized um, what we knew, need to do to be here. Looking back on this year especially, all the hard work we put in, it really kind of puts it into perspective. This place is great, and there's nowhere better than Wisconsin. One-timer, Tassie, he scores! Look out, backhand, Horbach scores! Wisconsin has the I think this atmosphere that the crowd brings and um, the city of Madison just brings in general, just looking around and, and seeing everybody and can't even hear yourself think sometimes when we score or something big happens in the game with how loud it is in there. and. Um, just looking up and seeing three bowls full, um, you know, 15,000 people in uh, all wearing red. Chills usually is the best word for that. Badger sees it, Bell! Puts it in! Six and a half seconds left! It is, I think it's the loudest place in the country. We have 15,000 people here, and the fans are awesome. Our students are awesome, so it is the best atmosphere in college hockey. When you're playing and you're on the ice, you don't notice it, but uh, it's the moments when you're sitting on the bench and... You know, maybe you're tired after your, sh your shift and you look up or you hear the crowd roar and you just get that in intensity up, the adrenaline going, or you score a big goal and the crowd's into it. It's, uh, you know, I get excited just thinking about it. Rebound, Badger score! David Celia! Oh, and Lindmark scores! To be able to come in and, and inherit the character and the athletes, the people, that I was able to inherit, our staff was coming in and, and have them set a, a foundation for us with the freshmen that came in, the transfers that came in, and say that they wanted to be held accountable and that they wanted to go at this together. I don't know if there were a lot of people that thought that this group would be able to attain the heights that they attained this year. You double your win total from a year ago. You actually had three more wins this year than you had the last two years combined. Back in the NCAA tournament, it was a fun ride to go through and you can only wonder and think about what's next. To have the leadership group we had this year to, to put those rocks down and, and, sh and show us what leadership is like and the coach to come in and be the leader he has. Um, there's nothing but things to look forward to, really. Um, the team we have, the kids we, we have returning are they're amazing, they're good kids, great players too. It's it's something I look forward to every day. Very proud of a, a really good season. And so for myself, our staff, and really our entire program, we're excited about what our future is.